Nigerian dancer Akora Obidi has revealed why she couldn't tell her side of the stories in the ongoing divorce saga with her American husband, Justin Dean. According to her, she said she was trying to stay strong for her case, but once she is stronger, she will tell her part of the stories. When I'm able to tell my story, I will share everything with you guys. Until then, please be patient with me. And please know that I have two girls that I had to take care of. And if I'm not there, nobody will. The US-based dancer went on Facebook Live on Saturday to state that she was being judged because of her husband's one side of the story concerning their divorce. We recall that Cora Obedi's husband, Justin Dean, announced that he would be divorcing the mother of two over cheating. Narcissism attitude and a few days after they welcomed their second child. According to him, he has been trying to make the marriage work but to no avail. But since the news, Cora Hobidi on Instagram has been sharing content and dancing in her usual style, which she was greatly criticized for, as if she really don't care. Some fans have made comments on her post, asking her to apologize and concentrate on her family rather than posting on social media dancing. Cora Obidi reacted aggressively to her fans, saying that Instagram is where she feed her family from, so she can leave Instagram details in the video. All of you saying leave social media during this period, are you mad? Do you know that social media pays me? Leave social media, then how will my children eat? Please get out of my page. I have the luxury of doing that. You think it's, it's fun and games for me? Don't just let me lash out on you. Not everybody is fun and games on social media. Some people get paid from being here, okay? And now more than ever, I cannot afford to be off social media. It's not, it's not fun like, like it is for you. It's a job, okay? Speaking on a divorce, Cora Obidi appeared the second time to address the issues. According to her, she said, When I can talk about my story, I will talk about it. When I'm able to tell my stories, I will share everything with you guys. Until then, please be patient with me. And please know that I have two girls that I have to take care of. If I'm not there, nobody will. I miss everything. I'm not, I'm not a robot. I'm just trying to make ends meet and to cope, to make sure that I am there, I am the strong figure that my, my girls can look at and see and emulate. That's what I'm trying to do. In time, when I'm strong, I will tell my own side of the story. But till then, please be empathetic and be kind with your words please well the whole issue of the divorce escalated after mr dean kora obidi husband came on social media to apologize for the statement she made that they were going to divorce moment after mr dean kora obidi husband apologized to his fans and proclaimed his former statement of him divorcing his wife why kora obidi keep on posting latest dance videos and show less concerned about the divorce well in a recent instagram post the father of two kora obidi husband noted that he was going to leave the marriage because of his mental health in his words he wrote i'm heartbroken anyone that knows me or watch me online knows that I'm dedicated family to both Cora and my children. The comments that I made about um, Cora being a chronic cheater were inaccurate to my knowledge. She cheated at the beginning of the relationship. It caused a rift. I have forgiven her and we have tried to move on. Um, everything, all the comments about these children not being mine are absolutely false. These are my children. I love them. And all other statements that I made in that post are accurate and correct.
Well, the famous Nigerian dancer Kurao Bidin on Saturday broke down in tears as she speak about her struggles with the divorce. Hi guys, um, I decided to come live today just to talk to you guys, my, my, my online family. I'm not one to air my dirty linen in public because I know the internet never forgets. just want to say I'm sorry. I want to apologize to you, my loved fans, and I want to say that I'm sorry. You might see me looking strong. You might see me dancing. You might see me trying to keep things together. And when you see me doing that, just know that I'm just trying to hold things together. I'm just trying to be strong for my girls. That is how I cope. I cope with dance and I cope with expressing through my craft. And it's a way of living. It's how I live my life. So I read and I can read all the comments and I can see everything that everyone is saying. And I just want to say that I'm not going to go here and say anything bad about my husband. I'm not going to do that because I know that it's going to be damaging to my family and I'm not going to do that. I have a toddler and a newborn. <laughs> a toddler has so much energy. A newborn is very fragile. So you can already think how I'm I'm the only one in America from my like my family is not based here i'm alone i miss my family i miss everything i'm not i'm not a robot i'm just trying to make ends meet and to cope to make sure that i am there i am the strong figure that my my girls can look at and see and emulate that's what i'm trying to do in time, when I'm strong, I will tell my own side of the story. But till then, please be empathetic and be kind with your words. Please. When I can talk about my story, I will talk about it. When I'm able to tell my story, I will share everything with you guys. Until then, please be patient with me. I'm not gonna say anything bad about anyone. I'm just trying to keep my sanity. Cause I've been there, I've been there and I don't wanna be there again. I don't wanna go into that dark place. I'm trying to be happy for my girls i'm trying to put up a front it might look fake it might look like i'm the narcissist not challenged i'm just trying to cope if you're a mother you understand if you've ever been here you understand i don't think that if i didn't have your support i don't think i would be i don't think i would have been able to hold it together I don't think I'll be able to act happy for my girls. And for the positive vibes, because I do feel the vibes. And I do need the vibes right now. This is, this is the most important time when I need the vibes, the positive vibes. You've heard a lot of things a lot of things online i promise you that when i'm healed when i when i'm in a better place because i don't want to say anything that i will regret i don't want to say anything out of anger i don't want to say anything out of you know hurt i don't want to say anything out of revenge no i will tell my story Please keep me in your prayers and please pray that I'm able to put up this act of happiness for my girls to keep them happy. I will tell all. 
Just be patient, okay? Please be patient. I will tell everything. And you will know all. Thank you so much. Thank you very much for watching our video to the very end. If our host subscribers, thank you for always coming back to watch our videos from Facebook, from YouTube. We really appreciate everyone that are supporting us. If it's a first time of coming across our videos, why not take a moment of your time to visit our platform and follow us on Facebook and subscribe to our YouTube channel. This is the only way you can support us by sharing and commenting and hearing your view about these specific videos. Until we meet again, stay tuned to Plan TV. Peace out. Don't forget to subscribe to get notified. And I see the show your support. Now say God, God bless you too. Thanks on the bed. Plan B T V. 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 Plan B TV. Oh.